Good job, buddy. So proud of you. You getting tired? Hello. What are you doing? guys holding the ends gosh it's so crazy noticeable when they're side by side like this how similar in height that they are like I would say I mean they have 20 month difference on each other you are so tall it's hard to feed you in mommy's arms You're getting so tall okay I'm gonna feed him every time I hit record I'm always downstairs we have the AC unit so just the one that goes out of the window and then his little air compressor i guess you'd call it his oxygen machine is so loud upstairs so i feel like i can't really hear myself when i talk so i'm always down here <laughs> i'm just so numb to it at this point i don't even really realize that it's on but i notice it when i'm editing i just have denver right here he is just in a diaper it is quite hot i don't know if you can kind of tell but it is like 30 degrees Celsius here, uh. which is hot for Canada, at least where we're from. And it's only May and it's going to get worse, but there's a lot of wildfires here and I know that it's gonna get smoky. So I'm trying to enjoy it while we can, especially with Denver. I know that the air quality is probably going to get poor and I don't actually know how that's going to affect him. Obviously it's it will, so I'm just gonna have to ask that when we have an appointment on Wednesday. We have his first respiratory appointment since, I think this is probably since February, probably. So we'll see how he's doing. Like I said in his pediatrician vlog, he does seem to be doing a bit better with his breathing, at least our pediatrician thinks so. But you know, the numbers don't lie. We guess we're gonna see how he does on his oxy oximeter, oximeter, oxygen test we have had a very busy warm day i'm trying to stay out of the sun as much as i can with this little guy we kind of make him like a little <laughs> little like we call it his little cave because he doesn't like wind and he doesn't like sun he was out there for a little bit but i think he's done and i have tonight we're making ham and scalp potatoes and broccoli and I love ham and scalped potatoes so I'm really excited for tonight and I can smell it cooking and it smells so good. Yeah you guys, I don't know if I'm gonna put the clips in before or after but I had a lovely Mother's Day. We went to something called Touch a Truck in a city close to us. And all it was for crime prevention we went and you paid like ten dollars and Dravy got to see construction vehicles favorite vehicle like I mentioned the blood truck is what he calls it but it's the garbage truck and he got to go in like five of them and he was just in pure bliss he was so happy and I was so excited for him <laughs> he was so serious the whole time he was taking it so seriously but we went to that we went to we saw my mom and my grandma. We went out for lunch with the kiddos. Awesome, I'm so happy that I got to see everyone and celebrate Mother's Day with all the amazing moms in my life. It's just a very good day and the boys made me a card and brought me flowers and I also kind of hinted that I would like to go to the spa maybe. So I booked that in for the 29th of May just to, I don't know, do something, I guess. Have a little me day. You might also see some clips of Denver playing with a straw. I don't know if you guys noticed, but his hand-eye coordination looks so good. In that video, I was so impressed. Everyone was so happy. They were saying that he looked like a little drummer, and he did. It was so cute. Oh, look at me, drummer. <laughs> <laughs> Drum solo. Who's that? <laughs> <laughs> Who's that? Oh, 
Why are you taking a video? Look at how good he's doing with these straws. Yeah, I don't know. I think he's looking at it. <laughs> he looks so cute. He's doing really good holding his head up. Let me see those teeth. Let me see. Let me see. Oh, I can't see. Hi. I want to see the teeth. He's just like Draven, like so similar in the temperament and stuff. I want to see them. Look at how happy. He sees himself. Yeah. Are you seeing you? Who's that? I know. Who's that in there? Handsome dude. Who's that? Can you say no way? No. You see, he's so good at it. Can you do it again? No way. No way. No way. No way. No way. No way? <laughs> Might also insert a clip that I took with Daddy and Denver. Can you say no way, no way, no way? You're yeah, right. Good job. No way, no way, no way. Can you say yes? No. no. <laughs> Can't say yes. Can't say yes. What the heck was mm. that? Mm. Yeah, I know. Boo! Oh, boo! Mm. Yee, yee, gotcha! Ah, it's got me! Ah, he's so strong! He's so strong, he's got me! Oh, he's got two hands! He's trying to bite me! Proud of how much you eat. Yeah, you crushed your whole bottle. No more peeping, though. He, uh, Denver, absolutely loves Alex. They're so cute together. I might vlog the respiratory appointment and kind of do like a mini vlog. Like I said, those are quite easy for me to do. I kind of just do it off my phone and I update and I just like when the kids go down, I oh. edit while I watch a show. And those are quite easy for me and I know it's nice to look back for me and I know that you guys find that interesting because there is a lot of moms that do have a lot of these appointments similar to me and it's nice because we kind of bounce back off of each other and i find that extremely helpful both for me and i'm hoping for them too and it's just interesting to kind of see how denver's been doing the doctors are really truly the only ones that know how he's doing internally i wanted to thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys had a lovely mother's day i will see you guys in the next video